as an, an African American myself, mm -hmm. I have found that um, we sometimes struggle with yes. reaching out to seek help mm -hmm. to, to, mm -hmm. to, to ascertain that stable mind. Um, as someone that's been in this field for, for 16 plus years, why is that? How do, what is that about? Why do we struggle with that? Why is it so hard for people of color to ask for help? It's the history of having to be strong. Mm. You've always taught your mind has to be strong and you have to be physically strong and you need to depend on yourself. So when it comes to asking someone else for help, we pull back because we mm. said, oh, I'm supposed to be strong. Uh, I'm not supposed to ask anybody for help. Or, you know, I can ask Big Mama or somebody mm -hmm. in the family and, of course, go to God. Yes. yes That's your absolutely. first resource. Mm -hmm. But we also have to understand there are some things that you can bring to God and there's some things that God needs you to bring and work on his own. And he's going to work through that person mm -hmm. to help you. Oh, I love that. And I love the fact that you guys hear that. Big Mama. Now that's yes. a, <laughs> I love that because, you know, when I think back, and I had a Big Mama, mm -hmm. right? And when I think back, we did used to go to yes. the the elders in our family to seek, you know, some wisdom, you mm -hmm. know, and help. And I love the fact that you're saying, yes, seek God, but also there's some things you need to bring yes. To the table, it kind of goes back with that faith without works is yes. dead. We can pray to God mm -hmm. about it all the time, but if we're not doing something and if we're not bringing something, yes. then it really can be, can begin to look mm -hmm. as though it's for not. But, you know, everything that God does is for a reason and a purpose. Mm -hmm. But I love that. So understanding that we've had to stand strong, yes. right? And you're right, it was ingrained. Mm -hmm in us, so to speak. Mm -hmm. um, what tools, could you give one or two things that you would suggest as a doctor and from your experience to overcome that? Just knowing that the strength comes in asking for help. Mm. You're the strongest when you know I have reached to the point where I need help. I need help. Wow. Yes. And that's a strong move within itself. Yes. So, that tells us, I mean, we have been told and, and taught when we're asking for help, it's like a weakness. Correct. And we're learning today that really it takes strength to even do that. And that is where you're being strong mm -hmm. when you recognize, I need some yes. assistance. Mm -hmm. Oh, that is powerful. 